Hey guys, welcome back and welcome into my closet. Today I am putting away winter and taking out summer. So that means all of my winter shirts are gonna go up there, which I've already done. And so down here is my summer stuff. So I'm gonna be putting my shorts in there and then all of my short sleeve shirts just hang down here anyway. But I've got some shoes that I need to put away and replace with springtime, summertime shoes because it is time. So here is the mess. I have a bunch of hangers down there. I have some clothes that I need to get rid of. And here are all of my winter shoes that I am going to be putting away. These are my Chelsea boots. I guess that's what they're called. I got these, I don't know, three or four years ago or longer. I got them from Buckle and they have been amazing. Actually, I've had these for a very long time because I remember having these before my parents passed away. And so that's been um, seven years ago. So I've had them longer than seven years, but they're not leather, but they look like it and they hold up like it and they're waterproof and they're just absolutely amazing and comfortable made of rubber soles. I just love them. Um, I don't know what the name brand is, but I just love them. So I'm putting these away and then I'm putting these away. These are kind of heavy. I got them from a boutique when I went with Kelly and Lonnie at Christmas time. We went shopping and they were only 40 bucks. So these are not leather. They're just kind of a material, but they're really soft and they're lined with fur on the inside. And they have some lift because they're platforms and I wore them a lot. And in fact, there's some rocks in there I need to pick out. But um, these, I just love them, love them so much. And there is no brand name on these at all. And then these I got at Target years ago and I have yet to wear them. <laughs> I had to have them. I have not worn them. They are like this on the bottom because I think I tried them on in the house a few times but I've just never had the chance to wear them or the right outfit because of the fur and all that. But um, I love them and I will wear them and they're pretty lightweight, but, and they are fully, oh, nope, they're not fully lined with fur. I thought they were fully lined all the way to the bottom, but they're not, it's just fur right here. But anyway, I do love these. And then these I got at Maurice, or Maurice's, that's it. And these are not rub or they're not leather, but they've held up really nicely. They're quite, well, they're not too heavy, but they are heavy. Um, they're waterproof. I love them, I do. And then these I love. I got these for myself for Christmas a couple years ago. They're by soft. I don't know if you can see that soft and they are very comfortable, very squishy. And I love the height on them and the, I love the platform and it's just like a, a rubber. And then I got these at Payless years ago before they closed their stores and just went online at least in Utah, they closed their stores. I don't know. But um, I wore these a lot. I didn't wear them at all this past year. But when I used to wear leggings, I wore them all the time. But I don't wear leggings much anymore because my legs just are not fit to be wearing leggings because I am not fit myself. <laughs> so anyway, I'm going to be putting all these away and then I'll get out my summer shoes. All right, I just found the box for these. They're called Not Rated. That must be the brand name in case you are wondering. And those.
Those are by Soft. And this is an empty box. Let's see. These don't have a name. These are just a generic brown box that those came in. And then here's the Maurice box. And here we are. Here are my summer shoes. I wear these quite often. They're by Eurosoft. I got them at Nordstrom Rack a while back. And then these are my loafers that I keep forgetting about. They're Sperry. And my friend Lonnie has this exact same pair. They are so comfortable. No blisters. They fit great in the toe. These are so cute with white pants. Oh my gosh. Um... I love these. There have been a couple times where I could have worn them already and I just forgot about them. And then these came from Target. These are the Universal Thread. And I love these. These are so comfortable as well. No blisters. They don't hurt my feet and I have really bad feet. And then these are my favorite sandals. These are by Timberland. And I got these from Buckle, I don't know, a few years back. And I, these are what I wear pretty much every day in the summer. And then I have these. These are from Nordstrom Rack. They're by Stephen. Um, Stephen, New York. And these are just the little stocking shoes. They're really snug and really comfortable. And I, they go with pretty much anything, actually. Because leopard print, I believe, goes with so much of anything so there are my summer shoes and of course I've just got some flip-flops somewhere and then my boots just stay here I wear these with dresses in the winter time and or skirts and I got these so many years ago before I even moved here so these are 12 or 13 years old and they're not leather but they feel like it and they have held up so nicely and I got these at the Park City outlet when it was um the day after Christmas um no was it yeah it was the day after Christmas when all the sales were going on and so I got a really good deal on them but I love them so I just keep them down here here's where I keep all of my shorts in the winter time, I keep them in here um, because there's just no room in my closet for everything else. So, and I could leave them in here for the summertime as well, but I just don't like having to dig through everything. I like hanging them up in my closet and then I can just see, see what I'm grabbing. All right, everybody. I have all of my hangers here and these are the shorts that I have and I'm gonna hang them up. Here's an extra pair that I've already hung up. <laughs> Let's do this. All right, I have put everything away and I know I have a ridiculous amount of shorts <laughs> but I can't help it I love shorts and I'm still in my pajamas just so you know but I love these these are by Union Bay got them at Kohl's a long time ago and then these are by Lee and all of my shorts are just past the knee because I love them that way I don't like my knees and so I always make sure they are covered. And then these are Sonoma. And I think most all of these came from Kohl's. And here are some that are crop pants, or what do you call them? Floods? I can't remember all of a sudden, but, and they also go into shorts as well. So I always roll these up and they've got the button on the side that has the little tab in here. I always roll them up. Capris, capris. 
I never can think of that word, capris. I'm always saying pedal pushers or something. And then these, I really like. These are by Cut, K-U-T. I got these at a little shop in the mall, at some boutique, I can't remember. I bought them when I went shopping with my mom one time. And these are heavy. I don't wear them a lot in the dead of summer because it's just too hot. Or I should say in the heat of summer, dead of winter, right? That's how it goes. But these, it's just so hot that I just sweat really bad in these. So I like to wear these kind of in the beginning of summer and then kind of the end of summer, early fall. These are super old. These are Union Bay. And I like these a lot. I do have to wear a belt with them. But the only thing about these that I don't like is, you know, when you take them out of the washer, the pockets, they get all wrinkled. And so I, before I wear them, I have to totally um, get out the wrinkles and lay them flat. And what I do is I'll take like this wrinkle spray and I just spray really, really well in these creases to like they're drenching and then I just smooth them down and let them dry and then they're fine. So I have those and then last but not least, I bought these at Kohl's last year if you remember. They were on clearance so I don't know maybe they were 10 or 12 dollars but these are Croft and Barrow. So that's that and I haven't even worn these ones yet. So, here's my collection, all ready to go. So I have all my short sleeve shirts here, and my shorts are in the middle. And then these are just sweatshirts and jackets back here. And then my shoes here. All right, let me show you what I am getting rid of. So I'm getting rid of this blouse. I got it at Old Navy. Um, you have to hang dry. It's rayon and I bought it to wear with leggings a few years ago, but I don't wear leggings anymore because I just, I don't feel comfortable in them. So, um, and I just think it's too long for me to wear with jeans and I never hardly wore it at all anyway. So I'm going to get rid of this. And then this was a Timu shirt. I actually bought another one just like it. The neck right here is so wide on this blouse. And I mean, it's like, so I'm going to get rid of this. I already bought another one and it's normal. It's good. Um, these are awesome. Timu, I think I got them for $6. I just love these. I have two different colors. I have white and baby blue and coral. I just love them. And then these I'm getting rid of because I don't wear leggings anymore. I got this at Walmart a few years back. It hangs past my butt. And this is super long. This is an extra large. I got it at Walmart for $5. I think it's a kitty. It's kitties and polka dots. So I got that. And then this I got at Walmart a few years ago. I'm just, I haven't worn it in a while, so I'm going to get rid of it, but that's cute too. So there's that. I used to wear, when I have tank tops like that, I wear my denim jacket over them. Looks really cute. Um, the only holiday thing I'm getting rid of so far is this Santa sweatshirt. I got it at Walmart a few years back. I mean, I like it, but it's just not comfortable. It's not very soft at all, and it's kind of tight. I don't know. It's, I probably could have got a large. Yeah, this is a medium. I should have got a large, but this was a while back. 
I mean, it's all right, but I just never wear it. And it's taken up so much room in my holiday bin that I'm just getting rid of it. I'm getting rid of this sweater. I loved this sweater. Um, I like how it's just a square bottom. It's and it's got slits on the side, but these arms are so tight. Sausage. I get sausage arms in these. They it is just so tight. But I love the color. Um I just adore this sweater, but I got it at Old Navy years ago and I've worn it a few times, but it's just the sleeves are so tight that it makes me feel, feel claustrophobic and I haven't worn them, so. <laughs> and these leggings, Daryl got me these for Christmas last year. And I'm like, why did you get me these? <laughs> and he said, I don't know. <laughs> but these are super small and super snug and I I won't even wear my black ones let alone camouflage <laughs> so I'm getting rid of these for sure I think it was just one of those things he bought online last minute just to get something under the tree mm. I love smelling my laundry getting rid of that these are so such a bummer. I bought these just before this last Christmas um, with my friends Lonnie and Kelly when we went up to the boutique store and that's where I got those brown shoes that I just showed you. I thought these were so cute. Well, they didn't have a bigger size, which I needed, so I bought the smaller size and then I washed them and they got totally... I mean, this was the style, but when I washed them, they frayed even more. And I don't tuck my shirts in. And any shirt I wear with it is going to have this big, puffy outline of fray underneath it. So, and besides that, they're just too small. They're quite snug, so... These I got at Kohl's a long time ago. They're really fun and cute, but um, I got them on clearance. And um, I don't know, I've had these for like six years and they go right up my crack, my bum. They go right up. It's gross. <laughs> and so I just, I'm not even gonna wear them in public because it's so embarrassing. I didn't realize they went up so far, but they do. <laughs> so I'm getting rid of those. And this is cute, but it's super long. Got it at Kohl's. It's really long and stretchy and boingy, and it looked cute with my leggings with the sweater over it, but I'm just never going to wear it. I've had it for years. And this I've had for years, and I just don't wear it. So I'm donating all of this stuff, by the way. It's a polo. Um, I think I've made a vlog wearing this one time. I don't know. I got it at the Park City Polo Outlet years ago. And it's just one of those things I don't wear. It smells amazing. Um... And it's just taking up room in my closet. It's practically brand new. I've never put it in the dryer and I've worn it maybe two or three times. So that's a nice shirt that somebody will get. Oh, it just smells so good. I don't know what detergent that is. And then this I got at Target one year for $5. I like it but it's a little snug now around my belly and it's also crooked, it's cut crooked. I don't know if it'll show, but this side's shorter than this side. It slants up like this and I'm constantly pulling it down and I cannot stand when that happens. And I've worn this a lot, but it's time to just say goodbye because 
if it's crooked, I just can't deal with it. This I got at Old Navy. It's rayon, so I don't, I'd let it hang dry. Um, great with leggings, but, oh, yeah. <laughs> but I'm just never going to wear it. I've worn it a few times, but anywho. And then this, I really like. I got it at Down East Clothing several years ago. But the problem is it's long in the front and short in the back. Look how short that is. And that's just how it is. You can't wear it so that it's even and I used to, I wanted to wear like my lip my jacket my denim jacket over it but the front would look cute but then in the back it would be like barely hanging out the bottom and it just looked uneven of course because you know why is it longer in the front and not the back I don't get it usually it's opposite so I have never worn this. It's brand new, but when I bought it, it was on clearance and I couldn't take it back. So I think it's super cute, but oh well. These I got from um, Target years ago. They're linen pants. Um, they go, they're like um, capris, but they're linen. And so when I wear them and sit down and then get up, they are just so wrinkled. Um, they're really wrinkled right here and then they get really wrinkled right here and I look so sloppy. It just looks terrible because you know how badly linen, um, wrinkles. So I'm not having none of that. And then these are just too big. The elastic is gone. They like, the elastic's not even there anymore. They got crunchy. And so I can't wear them. They're just way too big. And there's not even a belt loop. But I'm going to donate them because somebody could totally fix them and put in a new elastic. They're really nice. I got them at Kohl's. They're Sonoma brand. I like them a lot, but I just can't wear them. They're, the elastic is shot. And here is another one, the same pair, but in tan, no elastic. In fact, I have a, an, an, a safety pin right there, but yeah, they're really still really nice. And so somebody can fix them with, with an, an elastic, but I'm not a sewer. I don't know how. And then this I'm getting rid of. I got this at... Ross, I think it was. I used to wear it to bed all the time, but it's small and tight and I just, I never wear it anymore just because it's uncomfortable. And then finally, this is so darling. I got it at Old Navy um, the year before last. It's a, it's a medium. They didn't have large. And when I bought it, it was great. And it's got rayon in it. In fact, I think the whole thing might be rayon. And so I never dried it. I only hung dry. But after I washed it and took it out of the washer, it totally shrunk. I'm like, what the heck? And so while it was wet, I would have to stand on it and stretch it. I would stand on it on the, and just pull and stretch and stretch it and try to make it the way it was and I I've worn it one time and I just I'm not messing with that again so usually it doesn't shrink rayon usually doesn't shrink when you just take it out of the wash I washed it in cold it doesn't shrink but this sure did I don't understand maybe because it's kind of puckery I don't know so I can't wear that I'm getting rid of that and that is it, you guys. That is what I'm getting rid of. This is my springtime, summertime closet, and I'm excited. It's 46 today, but by the weekend, it's going to be in the 70s and 80s. And I'm hoping that it will be the beginning of spring 
for good and only getting hotter, I hope. All right, you guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, will you please hug the thumbs up button? I'd sure appreciate it. And I just love ya, and we'll see you next time.